Field training exercise is just basically uh, getting the soldiers out in the field, out of garrison, and teaching them field craft and basic tactical skills so that they can survive and accomplish the mission in a combat environment. I'm First Sergeant Kinkle, the First Sergeant of Charlie Company, 148 Infantry Battalion, uh, the best dang infantry battalion and company in the Army. And I love my job. It is the best job now. Yeah. The three field training exercises we do in basic combat training are, number one is hammer. That's an overnight field exercise. Number two is anvil. That is a two-night exercise. And then the culminating event is forge. That's a three-night exercise. So basically, it goes along with our motto of transforming civilians into soldiers and tra and making steel. That's our motto. So the, the process is you, you hammer the steel against an anvil, and then you put it in the forge to treat it with heat, and it becomes, iron, it becomes steel. I'm going to be talking to about uh, hammer, which is the first field exercise we do. It's an overnighter. Uh, and, and what we do there is just teach basic field craft and combat skills. Uh, we'll do things like react to indirect fire, react to direct fire, uh, protect yourself in a seaburn environment, camouflage, and concealment, uh, individual movement techniques such as the high crawl, the low crawl, the three to five second dash. Uh, and these are very basic uh, skills that they need to learn and then the, the, uh, the field problems we do after that we build upon that and, be, and ensure that they are, have a good basic knowledge of, of combat skills. So some of the basic stuff we'll do is like the individual movement techniques. That's where they low crawl or high crawl or do a three to five second rush. Now when we go out again for our further field exercises, they'll build, they'll use that into attacking an objective. They'll, they'll move as a buddy team uh, and then one fire team will move up, another one will come up to a flanking position. So these skills are all built upon as, as we go further into the training. I would just like to tell the families of the soldiers, we really appreciate your support of them. Um, at some of the things we do seem a little crazy. It's a very stressful situation for your soldier who's here. Uh, but the purpose of that is to instill discipline because we have to have discipline in order to fight our country's wars if we're going to succeed. And we've got to continue to forge these soldiers into steel.